Travis and Kendall took the majority of the reps with the ones and twos. That was the plan going in. Uh, we know we got to find out about Kendall. Um, you know, Connor Manning did some good things. Brandon Cox threw some really nice balls in the, uh, in the second part of practice. But, uh, we're, we're in, a, in a good position there, in a good situation. We've just got to continue to sort it out. You can't do it in one day. You can't do it in one week, most likely. But, but uh, we've got to get it done uh, eventually. This is the case itself. It's obviously got to be done by you know, a week out from the first game. But, uh, until then, there is no timeline, uh, which gives us essentially three full weeks to, uh, to try to get it sorted out. But, but uh, it's an important decision, obviously. We've got to make the right one. And we've got to have enough of a, a body of work to evaluate to, uh, to make that right decision. Kendall strengths is when there's no play there to be made and everything's broken down to make something happen. That's his strength. And that, that's something your quarterback in, in, in the NFL is about five or six times a game. In college it's about six or seven times a game. When, when disaster strikes, you know, turn three technique loose, somebody busts or some uh, very dramatic error, the quarterback has got to be able to make a play out of that six or seven times a game. And that's Kendall strength to make that, that play loose. He's in better shape than he's ever been in. He's, he's, uh, he's, he's lived in the weight room all off season. He's, he's uh, 235 pounds, very little body fat, and he really has accepted the challenge. I said, you know, we've got a lot of quarterbacks here. Um, which is, you know, it's a good problem to have. You know, you, you don't ever want to go into a situation where you don't have a quarterback or a backup. And so uh, I was real pleased today. We got a lot of guys competing. And uh, like what I saw, uh, you know, initially being at practice, excited to get in and watch the film. And, uh, you know, the neat thing is they all do some things differently. But uh, there's, a, there's a lot of ability at that position with those kids. It was good. We just, you know, we just, we got to get an evaluation and you can't, you know, slowly do it. We want to get a quick evaluation. And uh, so we'll do that for a while. We'll do that for a while. Yeah, I was real pleased with Travis. Thought he came out. He's in, in terrific shape. Uh, he's taken uh, an active leadership role, more vocal, uh, operating the offense, the tempo. Uh, really pleased with the leadership of that position, really. You know, I, I, I don't know. He made some plays. He showed some ability to get out of the pocket and extend the play. He made some nice throws. Uh, made some good decisions on the on the uh, zone read and the uh, you know, rest of it we gotta have to see the film to, to really know. He, he came here for a reason and we you know we, we've been recruiting him told me to have an opportunity. He brought him here because uh, we thought that he could have an impact and uh, so we're gonna give him an opportunity to find out. Now it doesn't mean that he's guaranteed anything uh, but we had to put him there to, to get an early evaluation as we said before you know first game was uh, just a hair over three weeks so can't wait till week two and three to you know figure out if the guy can play or not so that's what we're trying to do.